Capcom back from CTA in Vegas picked up a, a cold. You know, you go to somewhere like that, airplane travel, uh, all the recycled air in the casinos and hotels in Las Vegas, a trade show where there's thousands of people all touching the same stuff. It's all gross. You're going to come home sick. That's what happens. But hey, you know what? The folks at uh, HTC and T-Mobile made it a little easier, easier for me to come home. Because the HD2 was waiting for me. That's why I got the hat on and I'm unshaven and stuff because I'm sick. Man. Anyway, it's the HTC Touch HD2, the T-Mobile version. Uh, we had our own uh, Christy Evans over at the launch party in New York a week or so ago. Now we got the phone. It's out in stores. People are getting it. We have ours. We're going to unbox it. Real quick, though, before that, special thanks to the folks at Best Buy Mobile because they're, uh, they're hooking us up with a couple HD2s for further reviews and then to give away to you. So stay tuned for that on the OnePod Bandit. Um, you buy a phone at Best Buy Mobile, you don't have to do a mail-in rebate. You get your rebate in the price that you pay before you leave. It takes the hassle out. Very cool. So check that out. Thanks again to them. Thanks to HUC. Thanks to T-Mobile. Thanks to Vegas for getting me sick. Let's check out the phone. All right, so I think on the intro I might have said Touch HD2. It's not. It's the HD2, as you can see on the box. Uh, just launched. $199.99 officially on contract. Already seeing it for... Uh, 150 I think even $100. Thanks stuff for $99.99 a couple of places online. So definitely uh, shop around before you buy because I think you can get the one, this one for 100 bucks on contract now. Uh, also seen some ads on TV already for this, the HTC ads for it. Pretty cool. Um, so here we go. We had the unlocked version of this a while back, now officially on a U.S. carrier, of course, with 3G, uh, T-Mobile's 3G banding, but 4.3-inch display. Uh, I mean, this thing is just the, the form factor. This is so neat because it's, hey, there I am. What's going on? Because uh, it's it's so large, the display, but it's still very thin and, uh, you know, relatively lightweight. It feels solid, but relatively lightweight, and I think, you know, pocketable. It's not going to be for everybody, this form factor, but it is pretty cool um, if you want the massive display and everything that comes with it. Not sure if, the, yep, the battery is in there, so it's firing up. Uh, in the meantime, on the box, you see on the back, you know, a lot of content tie-ins here with Transformers, Blockbuster On Demand, MOBA TV. It's got the 1 gigahertz processor, the screen, like we said, 16 gigs of memory, 5 megapixel camera, and, of course, it is uh, Windows Mobile 6.5. So while this is loading up, we'll open up the rest of the box here. Forgive my sniffling and everything. I'm very sorry. I just, uh, you know, I want to get this out to you. And then I'm going to bed with some chicken soup, watch some NCAA games tonight. You get your start guide, your return policy warranty, your hotspot, terms and conditions, because the phone does have Wi-Fi, uh, as well as the 3G. I got a chance to try out uh, T-Mobile's new HSDPA Plus network out in Vegas with their WebConnect rocket stick. It's fast. It is very fast. It's actually, uh, it's interesting because it's theoretically their 21 um, megabit per second network is faster than Sprint's implementation of WiMAX. Um, also in the box here you get your USB to micro USB cable with your modular uh, charger that you snap on there. You can see the phone is loading. Uh, you get a three and a half millimeter stereo headset and you get, uh, oh this is cool, you get a little a little skin. So it comes, very nice, it comes with a protective skin. So you can just uh, slide that onto the back of your phone there. Although I do like the way this phone is um, without the skin. But if you want the skin, that's cool. They give you one in the box. Very nice. But yeah, I had a chance to check out the uh, the new HSDPA Plus network in Vegas. It's it's live in Philly now, and they had it live at uh, the Vegas Convention Center and on the Strip. And uh, it, it it's fast. We In testing, we, uh, we got over 8 megabits per second download a couple of times. And then even on my, uh, I have a, a WebConnect stick that's not the 21 megabits per second, but it's just the 7.2. And even on that, I was able to do some, I uploaded a video while I was on a shuttle bus from the convention center back to my hotel. And that was, uh, that was something, you know, in, in real world usage. I was shocked that I could do that, but it was very cool. Uh, all right, I'm going to connect to, uh, Connect to a network. So my email's set up, and now I can set up my social networks because it's got the HTC Sense system on here. So uh, we'll set up my Twitter account. Here's my Twitter address if you want to follow me on Twitter. It's Phone Dog Noah. Uh, the other Phone Doggers have their own Twitter feeds as well, so you can check them out. It's all on the site. You go to our site, you can find the Phone Dog guy. Uh, all the info on the editors. But there's there's uh, Phone Dog Noah, my password.
All right, well, I went off camera for a while there because I was having problems uh, linking to my Twitter account, and then I tried Facebook. I couldn't link to that either. So I don't know what's going on, but uh, I double-checked the usernames and passwords, you know, on, on a computer. I logged in and out of both accounts to make sure I was entering them correctly. But uh, I was, and but it's just not working here on the HD2 for some reason. So we'll get back to that. We'll get on with the unboxing here. Uh, we'll go to the home screen, and here you go. It's uh, HTC Sense running on Windows Mobile, so Windows Mobile 6.5. So I've got my home screen. You've got the Blockbuster and uh, Transformers custom content, Mobi TV, Barnes & Noble, Guitar Hero, Facebook, you know, a bunch of content preloaded into the device. And then you've got HTC Sense. So you've got your messages, your email. So my email account is connected and working, so I don't know why, uh, you know, why I couldn't get the other stuff working. Uh, here's the, the web browser, photos and videos, and uh, it's got some demo photos in here, so I don't know who this girl with the sunglasses is. We'll use this one. So, I mean, just the screen, you know, it, there's a lot of glare here from the camera, or uh, re reflectivity from the camera, so I'll hold it kind of at an angle so you can see. But the screen on this device is just, uh, you know, just huge, 4.3 inch. Um, really looks nice you've got multi-touch so you can do the pinch and zoom thing as well so there you go we'll go back uh, music player so if you're familiar with HTC Sense you know you're familiar with what's going on here 16 gigs of memory in the phone this is the first time it's loading up the music so it's loading everything up in there and uh So now you got the music playing, there's your calendar, stocks widget, recent documents, Twitter, which I'm not logged into yet, there's the weather, and uh, let's go back to the internet here, we'll launch the web browser. Uh, the front of the phone, it's got Opera Mobile, is the web browser. Front of the phone, you've got call and hang up keys, home key, Windows key, back key. On the side, you've got a rocker switch. On the other side, there's nothing. On the bottom, you've got your headphone jack and your micro USB jack. On the top here, nothing. On the back, 5 megapixel camera, dual LED flash. Uh, here's the battery cover, which... It's already loaded up for me. I'm not going to take it off. I don't need to deal with that. <laughs> um, so we'll go to my favorite websites here. We'll load up Phone Dog. So the on-screen keyboard, uh, so far pretty good. Haptic feedback. The screen is just so big that it makes it easy to type. Although, there you go. I guess I accidentally hit the uh, space. Well, no, I didn't hit the space. I'm not sure why they put a space in there. That was kind of odd. There's Phone Dog. So we'll load it up, and uh, there's the accelerometer. Oh, so it's loading. That's what's loading me in uh, the weird, weird view. I don't want weird that's for mobile viewing. That's why I want to view the page directly. Google. This will take a lot longer to load. Uh, start button, it's got the customized start view, it's got Telenav in there, uh, Opera Browser of course, Office Mobile, Facebook, there's your Transformer stuff, Mobile Backup via T-Mobile, Microsoft My Phone, Slacker Radio pre-installed, the Barnes & Noble e-reader, the Bing search widget. All right, and so here we go. The page loaded up as it should be, and uh, you know, it's great. It's a huge screen, and you can easily rotate. Let's see, easily to rotate that way. There you go. You can easily rotate uh, landscape and portrait modes, and Opera Mobile, it's nice because by default, it just shows you the page. There's no toolbar, no URL bar at the top or anything. You can obviously hit the little button to get back to your settings. 
Um, but uh, it's just, you know, and then you've got your multi-touch, so you can you can zoom in on things, and just really looks terrific. Obviously, the scrolling, you know, it's a Snapdragon 1 gigahertz processor inside the device, so the scrolling and the rendering and the refreshing is all good. And uh, there you go. Let's go back to the home screen here, and we'll take a look at some of this com custom content. You got it. It's cloudy out right now. So the uh, actually it's not cloudy out, but the weather report said it's cloudy out. So all right. So here we go. Blockbuster movies or Blockbuster Mobile rather. And uh, can I just watch Fantastic Mr. Fox right now on the phone? Please activate to download. Yeah, activate. Oh, I see. Okay, so I have to, they didn't set an account up for me, so I have to put in my information. So I don't want to do that right now. But uh, you can, oh, two rental downloads included with the purchase of an HTC HD 2. Very nice. I'll have to try that out. We'll come back and uh, I'll do that in my spare time here. We'll come back and do that. Let's load up the Transformers here, see what, see what happens. And there's the movie. So I've just got the whole movie here, all two hours and 23 minutes of it. Let's scan in. I don't know how much glare and reflection you're getting there, you know, on the video, but uh, it just, it looks great. And it's large enough you know, I could see watching a, a full-length thing on something like this with a 4.3-inch display a little more easily than your standard, you know, 3, even 3.5-inch three screen. Uh, we'll go back. A bunch yeah. of uh, other custom software pre-installed here. We'll, we'll get into all that as we review the phone for sure. Uh, I don't want to make this video too long. But you've got the uh, Barnes & Noble e-reader, the Moba TV for live mobile uh you know, streaming TV on your phone, the Facebook app, Windows Marketplace, Guitar Hero, YouTube app. So let's check out Guitar Hero real quick, and then we'll, uh... yes, let's proceed. Yes, enable sound. Yes, Rocker, that's my name. Oh, look at that, the Spirit of Radio, uh, Spirit of Radio, Spirit of Radio Live, terrific. Let's do that. Oh, Blockbuster was installed, good. Thank you. So we'll end it up with a little, uh, little Spirit of Radio here. Uh... Silviano, if you're watching, this one's for you. It's the HTC HD2 for T-Mobile. Just came out on T-Mobile. I think it's $199.99 on contract officially, but I've seen it online for, for $99.99, so definitely look around before you buy. 4.3-inch screen, Windows Mobile 6.5. You know, it, it's, a, the, it's cool, man. It's a huge screen with a thin, relatively lightweight, but solid form factor and a ton of functionality in this device. It's got Winmo, you know, and, and I'm not a huge Winmo guy, but uh, HTC Sense on top of it, um, and of course T-Mobile's new HSDPA network rolling out and all that stuff. There's a lot going for this phone. So check it out. Much, much more on this device, and uh, you know, any rush we can get our hands on over on Phonog.com. I don't know if I can talk while I'm playing. Can I? Oh, Star Power. All right, till next time, I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com. Be sure to check out our CTA coverage with, uh, you know, there's a new phone looks just like this runs Android. You might have heard about it. Check it out on the site. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.